if if your feet are too slow, if you don't have enough power in your feet, then you're gonna you're gonna try and put too much on the ball through your arms, or you're gonna mess up your release. Well, Aaron Neesmith, it's been one interesting rookie season for you and for every rookie around the league. This has been a crazy season, but throughout it all, you've figured out a way to show all the promise that the Celtics saw in you when they drafted you. You've been shooting the ball well, playing with high energy, and really rebounding the basketball at a high level, especially at your height. Uh, so those are the things we're going to take a look at here with these next few plays. All right, first, Aaron, I want to talk about the mechanics of your shot. You're the one who called yourself a sniper. When you look at a play like this, what is it that – actually leads to the release of the shot. Take me from the catch to the shoot of the exact mechanics that you've worked on through all those hours of hard work. It's just a quick one, too. So if you watch my feet, as soon as I catch the ball, my left foot hits the ground first, and I swing my right around so that I can get square to the basket without wasting any motion, and I just bring the ball straight up uh, into my shooting pocket. Well, I had to work this play in because I just love this action. It's complete misdirection. The other team has no idea what you guys are doing. You wind up with a wide open shot, but take me through this play. What are the keys in you working with this action with Jalen Brown that lead to you getting a wide open three pointer at the top of the arc? Like you said, a little misdirection. You know, if I come down to set the screen, people who, the person who always sets the screens tends to get open. So once Jalen tight curls his screen, he takes my man and his man with him. So when I fly off the screen, my man is in hurry up mode and he's trying to recover. So instead of trailing me, he goes under the screen, allowing me to have another easy shot. All right, so we talked about the shooting and getting you open and the mechanics of your shot. Now we're gonna talk about rebounding the basketball. Aaron, you're one guy, it's six foot five, in the middle of four different players on the Mavericks. How do you come up with this rebound among all of these players? Uh, it's just uh, wanting it more, you know, wanting to make the extra play and understanding that every possession in the game matters. Well, I can say this, wanting it more, Brad Stevens is gonna take a guy who wants it more 10 times out of 10, and you've been showing that all season long. You play hard every single time around the court, you bring energy to the court, you shoot the ball at a high rate, and you rebound the ball at a high rate. We're excited about your future, and we can't wait to see where it goes. Thank you, I'm excited too. <laughs>